Je moet naar bed. Ik ben Sandra. Ik zal maar doorrijden, anders krijgen we nog een ongeluk. Amnesia started, well, I had just made uh, Suzy Q, which was, uh, um, which was made for television, but somehow got a lot of attention, especially in Holland. And it was, I think it was the most awarded film of 1999. So people were uh, uh, quite, uh, how do you say it, anticipating my, uh, my next thing. And then, then there was this No More Heroes project, which were, uh, was a project that, of five movies. And I applied and I, I, didn't, I was in a very strange state, I think, when I wrote it. And I, <laughs> and, uh, I, I was quite obsessed with, uh, uh, and I already when I did Suzy Q, with giving uh, content, you know, the, the, the content of, of a story and, and visualizing it. And then I thought I should go further with that and I had some metaphysical ideas and try to uh, to make it work in the script. Basically, that, that was, I think, the idea. The twin concept came later. Uh, it was uh, during casting. It was I was looking for uh, uh, the two main actors, and then I saw Fetja, and I, I just had him cast for both uh, uh, parts. And then I thought uh, he's best in both. And then it just went. Why don't I make it a twin? And it was sort of it condensed the whole uh, content of the of the story, and it was much better. It was a great, it was a, I was ashamed that I hadn't thought of it without that actually. We're talking about a movie that I did um, 20, how, how many years ago? I don't know. Uh, what was it? We shot it 2000. in 2000, 22 years ago. 22 yeah. years ago, yeah. so it's all behind the marijuana wall. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so I have to, you have to refresh my memory a little bit. I mean, there's, I have definitely very vivid memories. I, I can't really remember whether it was a problem for me that he was playing two roles. I don't know if I had much to do with the other character. I don't well, you, remember. You, you, you've had scenes with, uh, uh, with, with both of them, but mostly separated. So, yeah. so I guess for you it was two different characters. I, I can only remember one or two scenes where they were both and you. And there were very short scenes, I think, also. Yeah. So I don't think you were... I don't ever, remember that being uh, a problem or anything. No. I just remember that it was a, a very... I, uh, the atmosphere was really great. I remember that we were sort of condensed in this little town yeah. somewhere in Belgium, was yeah, it? Yeah, it was. Yeah, in right Belgium. Yeah. Um, and, and it was summer and it was, it was beautiful weather and there were all these great actors. And, uh, but I do remember struggling with the character and I yeah. sort of... Because I knew, I understood that she was very troubled, but I sort of was trying to figure out what the trouble actually was. And ah, now the things come back, thing, things come back about the, 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 the fire, yeah. that I had a, a thing yeah, for yeah, fire. Absolutely. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah I was a, a pyromaniac or something. Yes, yeah. Yes, yeah. I don't know if I ever explained this to you, oh. but what happened was that b because you, it, it's, I think it's also a, a, a young director's stupid thing is that where you are very good at is, is uh, uh, getting, even if you get lines which are quite theatrical or, or uh, absurd, to make things uh, sound completely natural. And I wanted you to, to be mysterious and strange. So, uh, 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 and, and you, 
when you when you normally say things, it sounds you can say the weirdest things, and it sounds like a normal thing. <laughs> so I decided then to sort of keep you in the dark about motivations and throw you off a bit. Ah. And I think that was uh, why it was so difficult for you. Yeah, because because, because I yeah. also am a very even though I'm I very also intuitive. changed reasons. <laughs> <laughs> because I'm a very intuitive uh, actor, but yeah. at the same time, I, I'm very uh, intellectual. I want to, I want to understand it. So I have always uh. many, many questions, and I've been in the dark with this. But also, I remember with Game of Thrones as well. They n never told me anything, and I get really off confused. guard. Yeah, yeah. I get off, uh, confused, and I want to have s a certain kind of control f for me to be able to sort of then. Yeah. Improvise a little bit, but ah, now I get it. Yeah. <laughs> and you were like, ah, it's working. Yeah, it's working. Yeah. It's working. Yeah, I, I remember one scene. It's the scene. If you see back, the, the scene where you, where you're sitting with uh, with uh, uh, with Sasha, and you uh, you have to do, you have to swallow the pill. I completely threw you off. I said, do it again. It's not good. And you and you and, I, and you had a breakdown afterwards. Really? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Was, I would never do that again. No. Is het lekker? Heerlijk. Ja, dat dacht ik wel. Iedereen slaapt hier maar de hele dag. Um, zal ik Alex wakker maken? Ja, hij was heel moe. Ik vind hij lekker rustig met z'n tweetjes. Waarom? Hebben jullie ruzie gehad? Of verdorie, wat is er gebeurd? Nee hoor, we hebben nog nooit ruzie gehad. Lekker. Heerlijk. Waar zijn die pilletjes voor? Niks bijzonders. Kom, als je die tegen je schoonmoeder kan vertellen, wie dan wel, hè? En zou ze zich alleen maar ongerust maken. Nee, 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 echt niet, echt niet. De epilepsie. God. Er is niks om je ongerust over te maken. Ik slik de medicijnen voor, dat is alles. Medicijnen? Tegen epilepsie aanvallen. Aanvallen? Nee, het is niks om hysterisch over te doen. Het is jaren geleden dat ik zo'n aanval heb gehaald. En daar zorg ik de pilletjes voor. Weet Alex dit? Het is nog niet te sprake gekomen. Mag ik even gebruik maken van de badkamer? Ja. I do remember. I remember the camera falling on my on my on my on my, on my oh, breast. Oh, I forgot that. Uh, in like the, the, the epileptic, the epileptic, uh, epileptic fit, and then the camera fell on your face. What? Not right. on my face, on my on my chest. The oh, whole, really? the, oh, the whole the, thing the went. Box. Yeah, well, low budget filmmaking. <laughs> uh, <laughs> it just came down like that. Um, <laughs> I can't remember that. Was it, it in, just, the, in the in in the kitchen or something? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like you inside? were on the floor. You yeah. had a yeah epileptic fit. Yeah. Because you were very serious about it. You went you went to see epileptic fits and all, and and I actually got com uh, compliments from people who have epilepsy. Who said she really uh, does it well? And, uh, oh. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh, funny. And, and then and then and then Fetcher starts to uh, uh, give you what do you call it uh, mouth to mouth. Uh, uh, how do you call it? Uh, Probably didn't mind that. Probably didn't mind that. But also he does it real. And you see your chest going, and I and I I thought he would fake it, but he just did it for real. Really? And um, yeah, and he and uh, afterwards I said, but I said, yeah, no, I just did it, and he just did it. Well, this was before the time of intimacy uh, coordinators, yeah, I yeah, think. Yeah. Yeah. Jesus Christus. Volgens mij is dat niet normaal hoor. Is net een geslacht varken? Ja, maar dan zonder bloed. <laughs> Ik 
vind die Sandra wel een raar meisje, hoor, Alex. Volgens mij is ze weer beter. <laughs> 